I know a lot of people were using uh, like Tether as their currency. Like, in, like there's a big articles about that, like in Argentina, because their currency sucked so bad, True. right? That it was better to just stay in dollars and stay in crypto versions of dollars. Frankly, mm -hmm. I think they're using the Tron Tether, which I'll also never get, but sure. <laughs> it is what it is. <laughs> it's um, a fee situation because Tron, of course, is so, um, has such a low... Yeah. Maybe it has no, but uh, well, it's uh, fees I, and speed, right? Yeah. That's what you get for fees having and speed, a, exactly. a DPoS uh, system there. So mm -hmm. I, I understand it. And I, I don't think people got hurt. Maybe I'm wrong. Um, I haven't looked into that. I just know, I think if people were getting hurt regularly doing that, I think they wouldn't, they would have stopped. But I know they were using that and that was like the way. Um, well, so. if you look at, if you look at now, we're on a totally different subject, but if you, you bring up Tether, Tether is a centralized <clears throat> representation of your money, right? I mean, there's no no matter what right. you say, Tether is centralized. It can mint coins. It yep. holds the cash. It's everything. So that would be something that would be held under. If you're looking at the other uh, the standards for Fit 21, that would mm -hmm. be something that that is would be under the SEC most likely. Yep. Um, that asset is massive. If you look at Coin Market Cap. And you look at the volume of Tether and all its versions of Tether, it's a freaking monster. Yeah. Um, you know, so I think Tether provides a utility through all these blockchains that it's on. It's no longer on Omni, which was, of course, the kind of like the layer over Bitcoin as much. I think it's still there. But um, yeah, it's ETH, it's Tron, it's, it's, it's everywhere. Easy. Polygon. I think it's a great um, example of what we were talking about when we were saying that some things sometimes are not crypto or adverse to the the idea of crypto, but then they actually help crypto develop and yeah. basically reach people. And Tether yeah. is a perfect example of that. Without Tether, the, the whole market would have a lot less liquidity. Uh, it would be a so lot true. harder yeah. to to make those moves. So it is it is the way it works. We need to have uh, technologies that are kind of in between so that they help move this technology forward, basically. Yep. Yeah, I mean, if you look at Tether itself by volume, um, overall, as it's helping blockchains like Ethereum provide some utility, the volume is massive i mean it's it's yeah, it's, it's unimaginable how much it supplies just it's a just little number it, go ahead sorry mm -hmm. yeah just a little number uh tether uh 24 yeah. hour volume is 63 billion and the 24 hour volume of the overall crypto is 81 right wow right. so yeah. it's really <laughs> just way like most of the volume is coming from that. You can add USDC to that, yeah. which is another six. So yeah, yeah. yeah most of the stable coins enable the, the market, basically. Yeah.